Hey guys, this is Aria, and she is gonna help me teach you guys about measurement. Now last week we talked about elapsed time, which is a type of measurement, and this week we're gonna be talking about three more types of measurement, including length, which we use a ruler for. So I'm gonna show you how to measure. So using a ruler, I am gonna start, sometimes you start at the edge of the ruler, sometimes you start where it says zero. So I'm gonna start this ruler with a zero and I'm gonna measure Aria's head. Her head is about three and a half inches tall. She's got a small head. Then the next type of measurement we're gonna be talking about is the measurement of capacity. Now with capacity, you use things like a measuring cup. We're also gonna be talking about pints, quarts, and gallons. So stay tuned for more videos about those. But using a measuring cup, I can pour Miss Aria a nice little cup of water so I could pour my water into a measuring cup. And this is one cup of water that I could pour into her doggy bowl and she could drink her water. You want a little sip? You want a sip of water? No, I'm being shy. All right, then we are going to be talking about weight. There are three different types of weight we're gonna be talking about. And weight you can measure using a scale. And this right here is a scale that you use to measure weight. So the different types of weight that we're gonna talk about are ounces, which is the smallest, then pounds, which is a little bit bigger, and finally tons, which is the biggest. So ounces, you would measure small things like this little doggy treat. Oh, she wants the doggy treat. She didn't want the water, but she wants the doggy treat. I'm the same way. I never want to drink water, but I always want to have dessert. Then we have pounds and we would measure Aria using pounds. Now she's not going to be very many pounds because she's really tiny, but we would use pounds to measure Aria. And finally, tons are going to be for those really big things. And I have a picture. I can't carry something that weighs tons because a ton is 2000 pounds. But this right here, an elephant, is something that you would measure using tons because they are really, really big. All right, guys, we're gonna have fun learning about measurement this week. Bye.